currency events, such as annual proficiency checks, can be defined for each currency group. The status of each currency event can be easily monitored through color-coded lists. The chief pilot, chief of maintenance, or their designee will need to update the currency event records as they occur, unless the event is completed in sync through the EFB. To create a new currency event, select Currency Events list from the Staff Users menu. Click on the green New button, name the event, toggle the Active button to Yes, decide which currency group it applies to, and whether it should be limited by aircraft type. Set the currency interval and units. Decide whether the event should be updated automatically by syncing with the EFB and whether it should be due by the end of the month in which it is due, or on the specific date. In most cases, you will probably want the alert level to be everywhere. Decide whether you want the due date to be consistent. For example, you want check pilot restandardization to happen in February every year. You can always override the date. Decide how much advance warning you need to schedule and prepare for the currency event, or whether to use the company default interval, then click Save. The company default interval can be found under the company custom settings list by searching currency. Events selected to sync with EFB will show up when creating a load on the EFB when the non-revenue load type is selected. They will be under the category Tracked Currency Item. Note that Sync with EFB must be set to Yes both here and in the Currency group in order to sync. Music